So, what could explain this profound genetic solitude? One leading theory suggests this tribe represents an incredibly ancient lineage of Homo sapiens. Picture this as our ancestors first ventured out of Africa, perhaps multiple waves of migration occurred over tens of thousands of years. Some of these early groups may have taken routes we haven't yet fully mapped, reaching remote corners of the globe and then becoming utterly cut off by rising sea levels, expanding deserts, or impenetrable mountain ranges. If this tribe is a remnant of such an early wave, they could have diverged from other Homo sapiens populations before many of the genetic traits that characterize modern Eurasians, Native Americans, or other continental groups even evolved. They would be, in essence, a living time capsule preserving a genetic snapshot of a very early chapter in the Homo sapiens story. Their unique DNA wouldn't mean they aren't Homo sapiens, but rather that they are an extraordinarily early and unmixed branch of our species, whose genetic distinctiveness has been amplified by millennia of isolation and genetic drift.